Hey y'all, uh, man. Welcome back, man. Welcome back. Um, for this video, man, we're gonna switch it up for a little bit, man. We're gonna be talking about what Jutsu's should be in this game, you know, for season six. And uh, another one I would want for this game would be one of my favorite techniques in all Naruto, water gun technique. All right. Now, water gun technique is a technique that makes a finger gun with their hands, and through the hydrification technique. You know, you compress a drop of water in your index finger, firing it with tremendous force and speed is similar to a gunshot, which is really cool, right? And we have all sorts of examples of like water jutsu in this game. Um, you know, like di different like water prison. We have, you know, the shark water, shark water, shark, shark bomb, whatever you want to call it. Um, and those are cool, right? But I like the properties of, uh, the water gun you know what i mean uh for, for this game for this game especially for this game and how it will work would be uh similar to as you're seeing right now it would be similar to uh boruto's move i believe this is boruto's move right it's vanishing rasengan right now you just you pop that off and as you can see you can hold it you can able to hold water guns now this technique was specialized by the hozuki clan right um suigetsu uh, man gets who you know those guys um, and they, they're incredible incredible they're from the Miss Village but um, they're incredible um, and I seen this when he used this on um, like a, it was, I think it was a clone a clone of Toby or if it was Toby it might have been but he had double water guns like this this would be great for this game honestly this would be great for this game um, and I also like <laughs> the first time I've ever seen it was in the panel manga and when Anoki got hit with it, and I believe Gara used him, like Gara cloned him or whatever, he used a clone or something that Gara gave him. It might have been, or he used his own clone. But I remember he just popped him, boom! He popped him. It looked like he killed him too. Like you know, it's like a real gun. So it like that technique alone, I was just like, all right, this is why Naruto is just amazing, right? Like they they adding guns without adding guns, you know. So that's what makes this pretty cold, right? It's, it's a really good move. It's really fast. S a super short range, yeah. I don't know about mid. It could be mid range, you know, it's like a gun. It could be mid range, but firing some water pressure bubble from your finger enough to kill somebody like a gunshot is, I feel like, is one of the greatest techniques in all of Naruto and very underutilized. And I feel like in this game, it could be very fun to do. Like I said, similar. Like if you're seeing right now, it, it worked just like how this is working. Just like the Vanishing Rasengan, you can pop it right here, or it can be like a regular Rasengan. You know, um, how we use the regular Rasengan tool. But I really would want this. I really want this technique. It's one of my favorite techniques. But uh, uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think. But, um, it'll be similar to like a spear gun. <laughs> That's the closest thing we can get is a spear gun, you know? Shout out to you, Hakusho, man. But, uh, yeah, man. Like since we can't get the spirit gun, let's, let's let's get the water gun technique. You know, I seen it in Fortnite, as you see in right there. Like, look at this. They got it in Fortnite, right? Like, <laughs> don't sleep on this jutsu. Please don't sleep on this jutsu. But uh, let, let me know what y'all think. Do you, do you think that this is a good technique, or was this? Did you even know about this? Like, did you like this technique when you seen it? Like, how did you feel when you see this technique, man? I really would like to know. And what are you guys' thoughts? Put them in the comment section below. But I'll see y'all in the next video, man. All right, water gun technique for Shinobi Striker, man. Season six. Thank you. Boom. Put those fires in the chat. Put those feelings in the chat. Put those thoughts in the chat. Put those blessings in the chat.